Hey, what's up everybody? Ghost Guy Gaming here, and welcome back to another episode of Until Dawn. It's leaving off where we left off last time. I think I'm just gonna... Ooh. Hmm. Please don't let there be a window go when I look up. Oh, nice. It's the shed. Run. Run to the house now. Yeah, there we go. Someone who actually listens. Don't fast walk. Don't look. Just run. Nice. I would have done a tuck and roll there, but... Open up. Hey! Open up. Come on, open up. Guys, come on, are you in there? Let me in. Ooh, please don't let it be dead. Oh, punch. Mike. Oh, gosh. You look terrible. Is that really Mike? It's gonna look worse if we stay out here. Come on. Remember, guys, the window go it. Smack him over the head with a rock. No, don't. Mm. They said it can mimic people. Okay. This one's a smart one. It might just be luring us to the safe room. Mike, what happened to Josh? I got him. God, what an awful way to go. Yeah. Not only was it just a normal one. <laughs> what do you think we should do? Not only was it just not normal, it was also, uh, Maybe someone left out his sister. I respect the no lights rule, but I mean, it's visions sensed on movement. It's not like the light's gonna matter anyway. Any weird shadows that he's putting off? Stretched out hands, longer arms. How do you rate our chances of survival? Hmm? I'm trying not to think about it. Are there more down there? Lock it. Oh, yes, there are. Lock it, lock it, lock it. Nobody's moving. Shouldn't we be running? Yeah. That's Hannah, isn't it? Don't. Don't fucking move. Me. Don't. You know, moving your mouth is still moving. No! Please don't tell me to kill the mic. The freaking controller messed up. Alright, everyone, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. I'm gonna back out and redo that because that is bullcrap. And like I said, I'm only temporarily ending, I'm gonna cut back in. Hey everybody, I'm back. Sorry about the uh, middle of the cut video. If you guys noticed that, it glitched out right in between the freaking, uh... Like, it glitched out outside of the video lo... I mean, not the... <laughs> it glitched outside of the motion sensor location. I didn't even have a chance. So I started out, and we're back in the movie theater, and we're gonna do this again, shall we? Because I am not taking that. Bull crap. Greater chances of survival. Hmm? I'm trying not to think about it. <laughs> this time I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, jump down. Go, go, go! Oh, 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 oh. I'm just gonna lock the door immediately.
Don't glitch out this time, game. I'm not gonna stop talking to you now. Territorial, are we? You know, I guess since you see the movement of yourselves, y'all can attack each other. Ooh, there's the gas. Like I said, I might not talk a little bit. Ooh, light. Let's make a spark. Gas going. We can sneak out. Back on there. Ooh. Oh boy. Don't, don't freaking. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, he knows it too. Oh. There's some glass in his hand. Mike. I'm gonna save Mike. Hey! Michael run the switch. As long as I don't see no move. Yeah, I see no move. Just here that the box gets smaller. Ooh, I wonder if she'll attack another Wendigo. Yeah, that's definitely him. I saw the tattoo. so they can freaking fight. Or not move again. Alright, last person out. All I need to do is run through the switch. Save me so I can go Wait. It's dawn. It's not dark anymore. We have oh, there's a support. The is completely destroyed. Over. Survivors. Yeah, survivors, but you're also seeing A, the burning building, B, the probably seeing the spirit of the Wendigo just fly out. Fuck! No! Uh, nice, thanks for uh, replaying all my terrible choices. 
Like I said, next time I'm gonna go through and uh No! Next time I'm gonna go through and try to save that. Cause I do plan on replaying this game, maybe not immediately. But I do plan on replaying this game because I've really been enjoying this. Uh the old man, I uh Ooh. I, I don't know how to describe him, I mean. You said he thought he was stalking you at first. Did anyone else in your group think that? Well, yeah. <laughs> Is it possible they could have killed him? What? No. His friends? No. No, you, you, you don't understand. Don't you understand? And if he attacked you... He saved my life. And I watched him die. Yeah, I was torn apart by Beth. Jessica, I mean, not I Beth Hannah. Or why she was down there, but I know I heard her. He held it right up to my face, right here, right in front of my nose, and he could have shot me. It's because you he deserved it, Emily. He almost shot me, the prick. I mean, you go out with a guy for however long, and you think you know him, but man, this one really takes the cake. I was right there, and I could have done something. I tried to do something. It wasn't good enough. It's all right, Matt. You did good. He was out of his fucking mind. He wanted to hurt us. Okay? And... I thought he was the one who attacked Jess. Yeah, no. I thought we were close. After his sisters disappeared, he'd come and talk to me. He said I was the only one who understood him. I saw it. It's hard to understand someone who doesn't even understand connection. themselves. If you need someone to talk to... I'm fine. Sometimes, after a traumatic experience... I said I'm fine. I... I stabbed him, and I tried to get away, but I didn't know. I swear I didn't know. Didn't know? Yeah, we didn't know it was Josh. Oh, I, I stabbed the maniac. I didn't know it was Josh, but then he was the psycho. And how was I supposed to know Josh had all the saws and the gun and oh my god? Yeah. Josh you bringing in Meat Brain insane. next? Can I kick meat him brain. around a bit for me? I'm sorry. Meat Brain, Mr. Muscle Brawn, Matt, the Incredible Sulk. Is there You're something terrible. we need to know? Oh, no, nothing important except, um, you know, how he basically left me to die up on a freaking tumbling tower like a world-class douche nozzle. Hmm, I wonder why. This wasn't fast enough. It was so close, man. If I had just been Did good, Mike. just a little faster, I just... I could have saved her. If I decided to leap instead of take that wall. I could have saved her. So it's my fault. And the reason Jess is dead. I'm sad now. You need to listen to me. I don't care if you believe me or not. It doesn't matter because you will. You need to go down to the mines. What's in the mines, Sam? Mm, Wendigos. I've seen what's down there. And I'd give anything to unsee it. Man, everybody, this game was absolutely amazing. Like I said, I plan on replaying this, going through, and actually being able to find alternate endings. And everybody, that was the end of this playthrough. I appreciate everybody for watching. If you guys have any other games that you'd want me to play. Personally, I think I'm going to go ahead and play... Uh... I can't remember the name of it off the top of my head. Life is Strange. Yeah, that's it. I was going to play Life is Strange next, which is a game that I also want to play. Not quite horror, but also heavily based on choices. That's a game, that's the type of gameplay that I like whenever it comes to storytelling games like this. That's partially why I don't watch TV, is because you can't really choose what to do. Granted, I still watch anime and stuff on Netflix and YouTube and Hulu and everything. 
but I actually don't have regular television. Just the Wi-Fi so I can play games and stream and do things like this for you guys. I appreciate everybody, and, uh, well, this is Ghost Out. Later.